Okay, so random thoughts number eight. The power of logos. Logos rock out because, let's put it, is an image. And with that image, and the things associated with the image. Once you see that logo, it's going to be able to bring back all the information that you know associated with the logo. This is the power of logos. So for example, there's somebody painting in a room and they got a special paintbrush. You don't know nothing about this paintbrush. You've never seen the paintbrush. You don't identify the paintbrush when you get in the room. People that's not inquisitive, right? You can't identify it. It's not an image in your mind yet. Now, if you're inquisitive, you're gonna ask about it. Once the information is put, I'm outside y'all. Once the information is put with it, now every time you see it, you're gonna be able to pull it up. This is the same rules in regular images, pictures of people, name brands, all of those things. They bring up thoughts, feelings, emotions. They entice. This is the power of imagery and, and logos. Even in spirituality, you might lose all your tools. But as long as you have the images, you can always pull up what's associated with those things and study regardless. Deuces.